Hi TUSD, I want to show you a couple tricks with adding um, citations or researching within Google Docs. So first of all, I'm in my mytusd.org account, my drive, and so I'm going to create a new document. I'm also going to turn off this camera so we can see the entire document. So let me do that real quick. Okay, so I'm going to show you how to get this research window to open up on the side of your doc. So if you do not see it, you're going to go to Tools, and then research and a window will open along the side of your document that connects directly to the Google search engine and so I'm gonna research castles today so I type in castles and I get a Google search that gives me images or anything related to that search term and so I can click on it and it will open a new window and it can take me to that site or I can just preview by hovering over and it gets a little bit bigger so I like this picture so I'm gonna drag and drop it into my document and you will see that it also provides a footnote citation with a hyperlink to that picture. So that's one way to cite images. It also provides websites. So let's say I want to go to this castles.org site. It's something that I want to use as a reference. It has good information. So I want to use this. So I'm going to go back to my doc. I can actually preview the site with a little window right there. Click on it again to get rid of it. I can insert a link into my document. Oops, get back to my doc here. I can insert a link to my document by clicking insert link. And so it puts a link into the doc or I can also cite it. And so when I cite it, it gives me a footnote again at the bottom of the page. But let's say that I want to not have a footnote citation, but I want a real works cited bibliography. What you would do for this is you would use an add-on called EasyBib. So if I click on add-ons and I don't have EasyBib listed here, which you would have to add it, I'm going to click get add-ons. And so I will type in up at the top EasyBib, which is actually a website that is now integrated within Google Docs. So you will see Easy Bibliography Creator, and then you can add it. I've already added it, so it says Manage. So I'm going to close that out. Once you add it on your add-ons list, it will be listed, and I'm going to click Easy Bib Bibliography Creator. And it's going to replace the window. Oops, i got to go to Manage Bibliography. It's going to replace the research window with the Easy Bib window. So let's say I want to cite the website castles.org. So I'm just going to simply copy and paste the URL, go back to my document, but I need to change this to website. You can also cite books or journal articles, but I'm going to cite a website. So I'm going to paste my URL into that little box, click search. It's going to find that website. It might find more than one. This is the one I want, so I click select and it gives me a citation. And it will do this over and over and start adding up the citations in a list. And eventually when you are finished, you will just click add bibliography to document and it provides it, provides it as a works cited page. Hopefully this will help you and your students cite within their Google Docs. All right, thank you. Have a good day.